Bloopzilla Earth versus Abyssal Godzilla. What in the world is this title? We've been teased by Bloopzilla Earth for a very long time. He's been meaning to show up in a lot of videos, but we've never seen him in his own video. He today is fighting Abyssal Godzilla, who I have no idea who that is. I'm imagining, though, if his first name is Abyssal, he's got to be pretty savage, right? I mean, he's from the Abyss. And that's just the first video, though. The next video, we've got a bloop size comparison just to see how big these characters match up. But let's get right into the first one here by Pandy. It is Bloopzilla Earth versus Abyssal Godzilla. Now that, that's just Bloop. We all know and we all love Bloop. But what is he, what is he doing at the start? He's just chilling in, in the ocean. Okay, now hold up a minute. Abyssal Godzilla, right? That thing, isn't that like an anglerfish sort of situation? Yeah, I mean, if I'm looking up anglerfish, I mean, look at this bad boy right here. That is disgusting for one. But it kind of does resemble what's going on on the screen right here. He's got the light and everything, but does he look like that? I'm assuming we're about to find out. He's going towards the light, which you should never do in the bottom of the ocean. He's going to eat it? No, uh-uh, no, we gotta go back and see that. I wanted to see what the face looks like, and I kind of regret it, guys. Look at the face. You can't see all of them, but you could see enough to be like, you know what? I don't think I ever want to go to the bottom of the ocean. You might see a missile Godzilla. And then apparently he was eaten. Bloop, he's gone. But Bloopzilla Earth, he ate two of them. R.I.P. R.I.P. to my boy Bloop. But also, R.I.P. to the other Bloops. Because they were just kind of eating. Okay. Can we just do a quick size comparison here? Before we actually get to the regular size comparison. Because we've got half of a Bloop right under my picture right now. And then to the right. Look how much more ginormous Bloopzilla Earth is than that half a body. It kind of just doesn't even match up at all. But here we go though. Bloopzilla Earth versus this creature from the bottom. Abyssal Godzilla. Oh, he tried to eat him already. Oh my goodness. Abyssal Godzilla look crazy. But Bloopzilla Earth, though, is he bigger than him? Hold up a minute. Oh, this could be a good fight. He just smacked Bloopzilla Earth. <laughs> I want to know how big that Godzilla is. Abyssal Godzilla. If he's that big, like the same size as Bloopzilla, Bloopzilla Earth, that's what I'm saying. Ooh, he's starting off nice. Let me see this atomic breath or whatever you want to call this. It's kind of like a beam, like Shen Godzilla. He lifted Bloopzilla Earth out of the water. He's still alive though, hold up. Wait a minute, who's winning this fight? Handy with the animation and Bloopzilla Earth with the atomic whatever that's called. I forgot what Godzilla Earths is called. Is it doing anything to him? It burned his arms, that's it. Okay, we've got a fight here. We've got a good fight. Oh! Rip it off! Oh, he said, no, nah, I'm ripping it open. Oh, not the beam. The beam straight to the mouth? Let me guess. That's the... That's not the end yet. Hold up. Loops of the earth, buddy! He's toasty! His mouth! And look at Abyssal Godzilla. Don't look at me, man. Godzilla Earth? Pulled up to the occasion? That is gonna be the end of this video. And I'm not gonna lie to you, I can't wait to see that animation in the future. But now we've got Roy Play with a bloop size comparison. That lady was just eaten. Okay, R.I.P. Already starting off with Bloop eating somebody. Ocean Sunfish? I was about to say, that is definitely Bloop. Not Ocean Sunfish. 
So we're going to see how other characters kind of match up against them. They're all, by the way. Look where they're going. Right into Bloob's mouth. The Great Hammerhead, 15 feet. Doesn't matter. Oh, no. We got the Narwhal, and we've got a human trying to get away. He's gone. Never mind. She swam next to him. I like it. The Manta Ray, a basking shark. They stand absolute zero chance. I wonder what they're going to say bloop in feet is, though. Because a lot of people say different things. So I want to say what I, I want to see what Roy has to say about this one. Roy play with the size comparison, though. We've got bloop on the left. A whale shark just swims right into his mouth. That's how big the bloop is. And a humpback whale. It just stands at zero chance. Sperm whale at 60 feet, by the way. 60 whole feet. Watch, watch where it goes. Let's see what happens. Yeah, he's just eating. <laughs> just like that, eating whole. A right whale. 65 feet. My man just ate a humpback whale and then ate a right whale. Or was that a blue whale? I don't even know anymore. 94 feet a fin whale? Don't tell me he's going to eat something that's 100 feet tall, basically. Or long. Oh, my gosh. Bloop! And there's the blue whale at 100 feet in length. No way. Not happening, right? Hold on. Blue whale is getting eaten whole. Are you kidding me right now? Lion's mane jellyfish? Oh, see, this one's kind of easy. It's going to shock him, but... I mean, the only long thing about it is just the tentacles. You know what I'm saying? That's what gives it its feet. A Type 209 submarine. <laughs> Bloop said, nah, forget the animals. I'm eating a 211-foot submarine. He's not going to eat it, right? Wrong. Hold up, though. Maybe the, the top of it gets passed. No, it, it kind of just split up and... He still ate the entire submarine. Blue, buddy. You got some stomach issues, buddy. I guess Bloop doesn't necessarily care, though. Colossal Titan? Why is he in the ocean? Colossal Titan, buddy. Why in the world are you at the bottom of the ocean right now? About to get eaten by Bloop. And he is, too. Look at him. Oh! Why do you have to make that noise? Uh, that might be too much for Bloop. Look at him. He's like, okay, I've met my match here. Okay. Uh, can we please get Colossal Titan's cheeks out of the screen? Dang, man. He couldn't eat Colossal Titan, though. So that's a plus for him. Dang, the sheer size of Bloop is just astounding. Now we're seeing him next to... We didn't see a feet... The feet of Bloop. We need to see that... That's still... I hiccuped. My bad. We still need to see that. Maybe we see it in a minute? Bloop. How how long are you, big fella? Oh, wait. Here we go. Big fella is... 250 feet in this video. That's the end of this video, but do you do you agree with the 250? I feel like we've seen bigger than 250 on Bloop, and I feel like he's about 500 maybe. Let me know in the comments. Other than that, I will see you on tomorrow's video. Thank you for watching with me. I love ya. Goodbye.